Yo, what's good guys? It's Austin here, or Luna. So today's story time is a pretty interesting one in my opinion. I hope you enjoy it. Leave a like if you do, and let's just jump right into this. So this story time takes place in 10th grade. Now, I had this person that sat next to me in class. Let's just call him Jake. Jake was a super, super outgoing, like, class clown type of kid. And he also really liked to sip and smoke weed and drink. Now, those aren't really the best traits to have, especially sipping lean and drinking alcohol. Like, those are really, really bad for you. So, you know, in 10th grade, not the best time to be doing it, right? Now, one day he comes into class. It all started as a normal day. I'm sitting in class waiting for him to come in. Me and him were really good friends at the time. And he comes into class with a Sprite bottle with lean in it. Like, obvious as fuck. Like, nothing hiding it. And I'm like, yo, put that in your backpack. He's like, nah, man, she won't know. She'll just get a Sprite, like a flavored one. I'm like, dude, no, put it in your backpack. Like, it's not the time. Like, first of all, it's 9 a.m., keep in mind. And after he put it in his backpack, I was like, yo, why are you drinking lean at 9 in the morning? Like, bro, it's not coffee. You don't wake up and you're like, oh, I need an energy drink. You don't grab lean. That's just not how that works. He's like, I don't know, bro, I'm stressed. I'm like, fine, just don't pull it out in class. Not a good idea. Because I didn't want him to get fucking suspended or, like, expelled or something. Like, I was worried about him. So anyway, we're, like, halfway into class, and sure enough, this kid opens his backpack and starts sipping on it. And I'm like, yo, stop. And he starts laughing, like, loud. Like, he's laughing so hard because I told him to stop. And, of course, the teacher hears this, and she's like, are you guys okay over there? What's going on? And my friend's like, we're good. And he starts laughing even harder. And she goes, okay, please be quiet for the rest of class. He's like, all right, we will. And then, of course, this one other kid, okay, let's just call him Joey. This kid named Joey, who's, like, right across from us, sitting right across, sees what my friend has in his hand, and he's like, yo, are you sipping in class? And he starts laughing. And the teacher's like, sipping what? And my friend quickly puts the Sprite in his backpack. And I'm thinking, like, fuck, like, oh, no. And she goes, what are you sipping on? Why don't you stand up and show the class, Jake? And Jake's like, no, nothing just Sprite. And she's like, all right, you know what? Both of you go to the office. And she points at me and him. And I was like, wait, me? She's like, yeah, clearly you're involved with this. I was like, no, I'm not. And she's like, I don't care. Go to the office. You were talking to. And in my head, I'm like, fuck. Okay. So I get up with Jake and we walk up to the office and she gets on the phone to call the office and tell them why we're coming up there. And when we get up to the office, we're met by a security guard and the principal and we're immediately searched. And of course, they find his fucking lean. And he just goes, that's not mine. And the principal goes, all right, well, we're going to find out. So we go in the principal's office and she asks us a bunch of times, you know, whose is it? Whose is it? And he wouldn't say it's his. And I'm not going to say it's mine because it wasn't mine. So I kept saying, no, it's not mine. So eventually they just settled on the fact that it was Jake's because it was in his backpack and he was drinking it. So luckily they let me off the hook in that aspect. But because we were being distracting in class, I still got detention, which I think is bullshit. But, you know, whatever. At least I didn't get what Jake got. Jake got suspended for a week because, you know, he brought drugs to school. Actually, they were pretty nice to him about it. Like, a week suspension is a lot better than what most people would have gotten. But, yeah, he uh, was out of school for a week, and then he came back, and he was in school suspended for two days as well after that week. And he didn't bring any more lean to school. Now, moral of the story is, don't bring lean or any drugs to school ever. It's a terrible idea. Don't fuck with that shit to begin with. But yeah, just don't be like Jake, okay? But yeah, that's pretty much the end of the story time. I was okay in the end. He was okay in the end. I think he learned his lesson. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this story time. Leave a like on the video if you guys did enjoy it. Feel free to leave your story times in the comments down below. And subscribe if you're new. I'll see you guys all later. Peace. Taking what I want like pirates. Niggas make their dough from Pyrex. I'm just in the studio. I don't want coronavirus. Wish I had some silo salmon. I get then, I get now, I get next. Watch me flex and put dicks. I'm so stressed. Fuck. Hey, I can't even go to the club. Wait, I don't even like going to the club.